Welcome to our tutorial on adding equations. First, I'm going to insert a washer. Insert, new component, browse. Let's choose my washer and click open. Let's drop it somewhere here. Now we'll zoom in. Before I add a formula, I want to show you something. Let me mate the washer to the top of the lid. Select Mate, and Accept. See what's happened? The edge of the hole that I used to mate the washer to the top of the lid was created at the assembly level. Now, if I right-click and select Edit Part, we don't see the hole anymore. If I expand the washer branch and start to work here, let me start to edit. I end up with a number of warning symbols. The problem is that one of the mates is broken right now. Basically, the edge of the hole, which I use to mate the washer, is simply not here right now. Be conscious of situations like this. Let's cancel out of this for now. We'll discard our changes. We have an explanation message. One of the mates was suppressed, invalid, or not present, as we determined just a moment ago. We are going to close this. And let's right click. Oops, let's go to the assembly level. Edit assembly, right click, and delete. Confirm delete, yes. Instead, I'm going to use this edge. Control select this edge, mate. Instead of a coincident mate, I'm going to use a concentric mate. Now I'll right click, select other, select this face, and this face. Oops, I selected the wrong face here. Let's clear those selections. Right click, select other this face, and this one. Click Accept. Now let's right-click and edit Sketch 1. Double-click on this dimension. From the drop-down menu, select Add Equation. Now I'm going to double-click on this cylindrical segment. Let's say minus 0.15. Click OK. Our equation registers right here with a value of 0.65 inches. Right now we see that the equation is active. Let's click OK. You see this dimension is 0.65 and it's driven by a formula. Let's exit our sketch. Now if I go to the lid, and let's edit that sketch, we'll change this dimension to, say, 0.6, accept, exit the sketch. As you see, the washer has followed. Let's right-click, oops, right-click, Edit Feature, right-click, Edit Equation. Now we see the value is 0.45. We can simply edit this equation from this interface. Let's enter 0.2, OK. OK. And let's go to the assembly and rebuild. This concludes our tutorial on adding equations.